Hello and how are you all today? The question says A, B, C and D entered into a partnership. A, B and C respectively subscribed 1 by 3, 1 by 4, 1 by 5th part of the capital and rest was subscribed by D. D is a working partner and gets 4% of the total profit for that. The rest is divided among A, B, C, D in the ratio of their capitals. Find the share of A, B, C and D in the total profit of rupees 10 lakh. Now here let us start the solution. We are given that the capital subscribed by A, B and C respectively are 1 by 3, 1 by 4 and 1 by 5. So, and the remaining is contributed by D. So it will be 1 minus the sum of all these shares. So we have it as 1 minus. We take it, we take the LCM of these 3 and that is their multiplication. So we have 20 plus 15 plus 12. That is 1 minus. 47 upon 60 that is equal to 13 upon 60. Let us convert all of them also into having a denominator as 60. So for this we need to multiply the numerator and denominator by 20 to get in the denominator 60. Here it will be by 15. And here it will be by 12. So we can see that the profit sharing ratio is equal to the capital sharing ratio and since the denominators of A is to B is to C is to D are all same so we will take the numerator that is 20 is to 15 is to 12 is to 13 again 20 is to 15 is to 12 is to 13 this is our profit sharing ratio now we have the total profit given to us in the question as rupees 10 lakh now out of this 10 lakh we are given Four percent of profit is given to D as he is the working partner. So four percent of ten lakh comes out to be forty thousand. So forty thousand out of this ten lakh are already given to D. So let us find out the remaining profit. That is rupees 10 lakh minus 40,000. That comes out to be rupees 9 lakh 60,000. Now this 9 lakh 60,000 is to be divided among A, B, C and D in their capital sharing ratio. So we have A's share in profit as 20 upon 60 into 9 lakh 60,000. Similarly, we have B's share in profit as 15 upon 60 into 9 lakh 60,000. C's share in profit is 12 upon 60 into 9 lakh 60,000 and finally we have D's share in profit as 13 upon 60 into 9 lakh 60,000. Now after calculating we have the respective amounts as respectively as 3,20,000 to A, 
टू लैख फोर्टी थाउजेंड टू बी वन लैख नाइन्टी टू थाउजेंड टू सी एंड रूपीज टू लैख एट थाउजेंड टू डी एज इन शेयर ऑफ देयर प्रॉफिट एंड डी टोटल शेयर इज एडिंग रूपीज फोर्टी थाउजेंड इन इट दैट टोटल अमाउंट कम टू बी डीज टोटल शेयर इन प्रॉफिट rupees 2,48,000. So this is what we need. We need not write it here. We can write it here in the bracket. That is 2,8,000 plus 40,000. Right. So this completes the session. Hope you understood the whole concept well. Do you take care of your calculations? Do. the question good in exam have a nice day